Hello everybody, my name is Coriander and welcome back to Dark Souls 2 Scar of the First Sin. Now if you know anything about Dark Souls or if you follow From Software at all, you'll know that Dark Souls 3 is coming out in exactly two weeks, give or take a couple hours. And to get hyped for that, I'm going to be picking up Dark Souls 2 again, right where we left off. I won't lie, I have no fucking idea where we left off. But we're gonna go with our Coriander character and s try and remember. Alright, where are we at? Oh, okay. We can do one of two things. We can fight the chariot. Or we can go straight through to the covetous demon in Mytha. Which I think I'm gonna do, actually. I think I'm about to suck. Uh, poison moss, just in case, I guess. Fantastic. I just love bows in all the Souls games. I don't know why. Usually don't do that much damage until you like infuse it and do shit crazy. Oh, that was close. <laughs> My poison meter almost got there. Don't worry. I'm gonna take this guy on with just arrows. Oh. He's actually not that big of a problem. His orbs move super slow. You can roll out of the way like hours before they get there. Plus you can only fire them like straight ahead of them at not much of an angle, so. Ooh, smooth and silky stone. I didn't think you got that from him. Uh oh, uh oh. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, wait. And fading soul. And just run over here, pick up some stuff, get out of the fog for a while. There's just a bunch of Titanite shards in this big pit. But there is noxious gas. So you have to wait for your poison bar to go down and you just start picking everything up oh no 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 ah damn it that's not a problem still oh god huh oh, that's close as you can see, a life gem gives you like exactly the amount of health back for every tick of poison. So if you're ever having trouble. Also, if you saw, there is Gavlan in here once again. Good old Gavlan. Wheeling and dealing. Gavlan know you. Titanite chunk, hell yeah! Alright, we're making our way downtown. Walking fast, walkers pass, and we're homebound. There's just, now there's just a bunch of guys worshipping women. You know, your basic fuckboys. Oh, headshot, yay. Oh, what did I get from the lady? Did I get something good? What did I get? Prisoner's hood, hell yeah! I've always wanted mediocre armor. Go up here, you pull this lever. It opens the big wooden door. Which doesn't make sense that you can't just chop through it with whatever weapon you have, but it's Dark Souls, so I'm not gonna argue with its logic. Also, these are poison pots, so don't roll in here, unless you want to get poisoned. It's bonfire. The hell? Damn. 
Damn. That's good. Got two of them in one go. Watch out for the holes here, too, because they will fuck you up. You will be absolutely fuckulated. Let's see if I can get this last one. No, no. God! Okay, great, great. He didn't run into the thing. So, yeah, there we go. Hell yeah. Got all the Titanite lizards in like two tries. Let's see if we can get the secret treasures over here. There's a douchebag in here. He uh, throws dark orbs, if you'll remember. Yay! I don't think he'll trap me in here. Oh shit! I like how the guy just sort of falls off and then disappears. Because it's a guy riding that guy. Uh, there's a chest down there. I can't remember if it's worth it or not. Also, in here. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna show you guys how to do this. I'm about to be fuckulated. Absolutely fuckulated. Oh god. Oh well, I'm in a corner. Oh. Yep, fuckulated. I got fuckulated. There are four half moon sickle motherfuckers in there. And well, they don't take damage easy. And they also hurt a lot. Oh, that one. This guy. Oh god, are they coming? Are they smart? Yeah, they are. They were smart enough to come all the way around to me. Shit. Fuck me. Please don't let me get trapped down here with that guy. Okay, this is the poison fog. Okay, okay, I made it out. Usually I'm terrible at that. Oh look, he's just yelling at a hole. <gasps> Did the other one drop down and getting poisoned? Because that'd be awesome. Are you serious? I'm invaded by a dark spirit. I don't know where he's at. Oh, I got a full moon sickle again. It's full moon sickle, not half moon. I don't know why I said that. Okay, I really don't want to fight whoever invaded. Huh. Oh, he was a bro. He understands the grind. Alright, if you don't know the way the PvP works in this game is, uh, there's soul memory. <laughs> Fuck. There's soul memory. And you get soul memory for however many... God. Alright, you get soul memory for however many souls you collect, like total, like it never stops going up unless you get a certain ring but any souls that you actually acquire goes straight towards your soul memory and soul memory determines who can it determines who you can connect with and who can connect with you and there are like thresholds 
and stuff, and there's ways to increase your range. But it's supposed to be, like, people around the same point in the game can connect with each other. So, that was a way of making it fair for everyone. Because people in Dark Souls 1 would connect to, like, someone who's like a level 5 and just absolutely destroy them. This fucking headless man. There we go. Alright, I guess for now we are gonna fight the covetous demon. Oh, just, just let this guy air out with his poison. Oh god! How did I even let that happen? Okay, I do that. Actually, do I have any? I do. I'm gonna use one of these. Oh, and I'm gonna join a covenant that is here that I almost skipped over. Alright, so in here is the Covenant of Sun. Or the Sunlight Champions. Maybe that one of those. But all you gotta do is come in here and kneel at this altar and altar of sunlight join the heir heirs of the sun that's the name become an heir of the sun praise the sun so yes praise the sun lord be to the sun praise be to him that give us warmth the great yellow orb in the sky. Alright, also, once you get in here, do not roll. Like, seriously, don't. You're just gonna have a bad time. See, look at this guy, being a fucking idiot, running into all the pots. Now he's gonna die of poison. God, look at him, being a fucking tard. Fucking idiot. Can I make this guy get poisoned? Come here. Yeah, there we go. See, the less work you do in a Souls game, the more rewarding it feels. He takes like 15 damage every half second or something like that. Up to like 1,015, maybe. That could be wrong. 1,000 and something. It's just it's basically just free damage. Like You have almost no reason not to... fucking do it. Oh my god! I forgot she fucking did that. I need to... God, that was dumb. That was the stupidest thing, or one of the stupidest things I've ever done. I literally should have just shot her with my bow, like I usually do. Alright, this guy. I'm summoning a phantom now to help me. Because I am just too fucking stupid. Alright, also, this guy is in the Covenant of Sun. That's why he is yellow. My lord. God dang it. This motherfucker. Alright, once again, all the help. Praise the sun! Ah, yes. Here we go. Okay, in this boss fight, it's pretty simple. You can just knock down some, uh, like there are things up above this guy. That you can just knock down. There's some guys just hanging on the ceiling and stuff. You can just knock those down. And he'll go and eat them. It makes this guy a super simple boss fight. He only has like three things he does. He rolls over. He swings his tail and he swings his arm. That's about it. Covetous Demon Soul.
Hooray! Alright, there we go, and through the fog exit door. And right here's our fire. The bonfire. Alright, here we go. Alright, that was good. Alright, now to go back and spend some souls. Don't know what I'm gonna spend them on. So I've got enough for three ish level no, yeah, three levels. Uh I'm eventually going to need attunement for what I am going to do. I'm going to go ahead and get this three intelligence because I need the three intelligence to talk to straight of all of this. I'm going to go with the vigor because you can't go wrong with more health, honestly. Okay. Alright, and that was the covetous demon. Alright, this was Dark Souls. If you liked what you saw and watched this far, please like, comment, and subscribe. I would love some feedback, honestly. And as always, thank you for watching. Once again, the three-pronged penis. It haunts my dreams. <laughs>